Good morning, brothers and sisters. Welcome to the Minor Basilica of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawa. We will now pray the Holy Rosary. Please kneel. O sacred feast, in which we partake of Christ, His sufferings are remembered, our minds are filled with His grace, and we receive the pledge of the glory which is to be ours. You gave them bread from heaven to be their food, and this bread contained all goodness. Let us pray. Lord Jesus Christ, you, you give us the Eucharist as, as the memorial of your suffering and death. May our worship of this sacrament of your body and blood help us to experience the salvation you won for us and the peace of the kingdom where you live with the Father and the Holy Spirit, God forever and ever. Amen. The angel of the Lord declared unto Mary, And she conceived by the power of the Holy Spirit. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Behold the handmaid of the Lord. Be it done unto me according to your word. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women. And blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. And the Word was made flesh and dwelt among us. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. For forth we beseech, we beseech you, O Lord, Lord your, your grace into our hearts, that, that we, we to whom the incarnation of Christ, your Son, was made known by the message of an angel, made by his passion and cross, be brought to the glory of his resurrection, through the same Christ, our Lord. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Lord, open my lips, and my mouth shall declare your praise. God, come to my assistance. Lord, make haste to help me. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The Glorious Mysteries The first glorious mystery is the resurrection. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The second glorious mystery is the Ascension. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The third glorious mystery is the descent of the Holy Spirit. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The fourth glorious mystery is the Assumption of Mary. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The fifth glorious mystery is the coronation of Mary. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. We fly to your patronage, O, o Holy, Holy Mother, Mother of God, God despise, despise not our, our petitions and our necessities, and our necessities but, but deliver us from all dangers, O ever-glorious and blessed Virgin. Queen of the Holy Rosary of Manawag, pray for us. That we be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. O God, whose only begotten Son, by, by His life, death, death and, and resurrection, has purchased, purchased for us the rewards of eternal life, grant to beseech you that meditating upon these mysteries of the Holy Rosary of the Blessed Virgin Mary, we may imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise through Christ our Lord. Amen. Prayer to Saint Joseph. Behold the faithful and prudent steward, whom the Lord has set over his household. The Lord has shown him his love and covered him with glory. He has clothed him with a splendid garment. Let us pray. Father, you entrusted our Savior to the care of Saint Joseph. By the help of his prayers, may your church continue to serve her Lord Jesus Christ, who lives and reigns with you in the Holy Spirit. God, forever and ever. Amen. Jubilee prayer for the golden anniversary of the Dominican province of the Philippines. O God, our Father and Creator, in, in whom we live and move and have, and have our being, we praise you as we gather in gentle grace and gratitude on this Jubilee of the Dominican province of the Philippines. O God, the Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, we preach you as the way, the truth, and the life whose name we proclaim whose love we strive to incarnate. O God, the Holy Spirit, Advocate and Guide, we bless you, and seek the outpouring of your presence in the witness of our words and works, in the consecration of our lives to holy preaching, in speaking only to you and about you. Let our celebration be filled with fidelity to our mission, with hope for your promise, and with true charity binding us all. In the, in the gospel, gospel we share, share with, with all peoples, by your will, O God, in your name, O Lord. Amen. Amen. 
Our Lady of the Holy Rosary, pray for us. Our Holy Father, Saint Dominic, pray for us. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Please be seated for a while. Good morning, brothers and sisters. Welcome to the Minor Basilica of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawa. Today is Wednesday in the 14th week in Ordinary Time. We will now have the morning prayer of the Church, integrated with the celebration of the Holy Mass. We invite you to actively participate in our prayers. Please stand. Lord, open my lips, and my mouth shall declare your praise. Cry out with joy to the Lord, all the earth. Serve the Lord with gladness. Cry out with joy to the Lord, all the earth. Serve the Lord with gladness. The Lord is the earth in its fullness, the world in all its peoples. It is He who set it on the seas, on the waters He made it firm. Cry out with joy to the Lord, all the earth. Serve the Lord with gladness. Who shall climb the mountain of the Lord? who shall stand in his holy place, the man with clean hands and pure heart, who desires not worthless things, who was not sworn so as to deceive his neighbor. Cry out with joy to the Lord all the earth. Serve the Lord with gladness. He shall receive blessings from the Lord and reward from the God who saves him. Such are the men who seek him. Seek the face of the God of Jacob. Cry out with joy to the Lord all the earth. Serve the Lord with gladness. O gates, lift high your heads. Grow higher, ancient doors. Let him enter the King of glory. Cry out with joy to the Lord all the earth. Serve the Lord with gladness. Who is the King of glory? The Lord, the mighty, the valiant. The Lord, the valiant in war. Cry out with joy to the Lord all the earth. Serve the Lord with gladness. O gates, lift high your heads, grow higher, ancient doors, let him enter, the King of glory. Cry out with joy to the Lord, all the earth, serve the Lord with gladness. Who is he, the King of glory? He, the Lord of armies, he is the King of glory. Cry out with joy to the Lord, all the earth, serve the Lord with gladness. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Cry out with joy to the Lord, all the earth. Serve the Lord with gladness. O God, all your ways are holy. What God can compare with our God? I cry aloud to God, cry aloud to God that he may hear me. In the day of my distress, I sought the Lord. My hands were raised at night without ceasing. My soul refused to be consoled. I remembered my God, and I groaned. I pondered, and my spirit fainted. You withheld sleep from my eyes. I was troubled. I could not speak. I thought of the days of long ago, and remembered the years long past. At night I mused within my heart. I pondered, and my spirit questioned. Will the Lord reject us forever? Will He show us His favor no more? Has his love vanished forever? Has his promise come to an end? Does God forget his mercy, or in anger withhold his compassion? I said, this is what causes my grief, that the way of the Most High has changed. I remember the deeds of the Lord. I remember your wonders of old. I muse on all your works, and ponder your mighty deeds. Your ways, O God, are holy. What God is great as our God. You are the God who works wonders. You showed your power among the peoples. Your strong arm redeemed your people. 
the sons of Jacob and Joseph. The waters saw you, O God, the waters saw you and trembled. The depths were moved with terror, the clouds poured down rain, the skies sent forth their voice, your arrows flashed to and fro. Your thunder rolled round the sky, your flashes lighted up the world. The earth was moved and trembled when your way led through the sea, your path through the mighty waters, and no one saw your footprints. You guided your people like a flock by the hand of Moses and Aaron. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. My heart leaps up with joy to the Lord, for He humbles only to exalt us. My heart exalts in the Lord. My horn is exalted in my God. I have swallowed up my enemies. I rejoice in my victory. There is no holy one like the Lord. There is no right rock like our God. Speak boastfully no longer, nor let arrogance issue from your mouths. For an all-knowing God is the Lord, a God who judges deeds. The bows of the mighty are broken, while the tottering gird on strength, and the well-fed hire themselves out for bread, while the hungry baten on spoil. The barren wife bears seven sons, while the mother of many languishes. The Lord puts to death and gives life. He casts down to the nether world. He raises up again. The Lord makes poor and makes rich. He humbles, he also exalts. He raises the needy from the dust. From the ash heap he lifts up the poor to seat them with nobles and make a glorious throne their heritage. For the pillars of the earth are the Lord's and he has set the world upon them. He will guard the footsteps of his faithful ones, but the wicked shall perish in the darkness. For not by strength does man prevail. The Lord's foes shall be shattered. The Most High in heaven thunders. The Lord judges the ends of the earth. Now may he give strength to his king and exalt the horn of his anointed. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The Lord is King, let the earth rejoice. The Lord is King, let earth rejoice. Let all the coastlands be glad. Cloud and darkness are His raiment, His throne, justice and right. A fire prepares His path, in burns up His foes on every side. His lightnings light up the world. The earth trembles at the sight. The mountains melt like wax before the Lord of all the earth. The skies proclaim His justice. All people see His glory. Let those who serve idols be ashamed, those who boast of their worthless gods. All you spirits worship Him. Zion hears and is glad. The people of Judah rejoice because of your judgments, O Lord. For you indeed are the Lord, most high above all the earth, exalted far above all spirits. The Lord loves those who hate evil. He guards the souls of his saints. He sets them free from the wicked. Light shines forth for the just, and joy for the upright of heart. Rejoice, you just, in the Lord. Give glory to his holy name. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Please stand. Let us pray. O God, who in the abasement of your Son have raised up a fallen world, fill your faithful with holy joy. For on those you have rescued from slavery to sin, you bestow eternal gladness. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen. Please be seated. A reading from the book of the prophet Hosea. Israel is a luxuriant vine whose fruit matches its growth. The more abandoned his fruit, the more altars he built, the more productive his land, the more sacred pillars he set up. 
Their heart is false. Now they pay for their guilt. God shall break down their altars and destroy their secret pillars. If they would say, "We have no king," since they do, they do not fear the Lord, what can the king do for them? The king of Samaria shall disappear, like foam upon the waters. The high places of Avon shall be destroyed. The sin of Israel, thorns and thistles, shall overgrow their altars. Then they shall cry out to the mountains, "Cover us!" and to the hills, "Fall upon us!" So, for yourselves, justice, reap the fruit of piety. Break up for yourselves a new field, for it is time to seek the Lord, till He come and rain down justice upon you. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Seek always the face of the Lord. Seek always the face of the Lord. Sing to Him, sing His praise, proclaim all His wondrous deeds, glory in His holy name. Rejoice, O hearts that seek the Lord! Seek always the face of the Lord. Look to the Lord in His strength. Seek the seek to serve Him constantly. Recall the wondrous deeds that He has wrought, His portents and the judgments He has uttered. Seek always the face of the Lord. You descendants of Abraham, His servants, sons of Jacob, His chosen ones, He the Lord is our God. Throughout the earth, his judgments prevail. Seek always the face of the Lord. Please stand. The kingdom of God is at hand. Repent and believe in the gospel. The Lord be with you, and with your spirit. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Matthew. Glory to you, O Lord. Jesus summoned his twelve disciples and gave them authority over unclean spirits to drive them out, and to cure every disease and every illness. The names of the twelve apostles are this: first Simon called Peter. And his brother Andrew, James the son of Zebedee, and his brother John, Philip and Bartholomew, Thomas and Matthew the tax collector, James the son of Alphaeus and Thaddeus, Simon the Cananean, and Judas Iscariot, who betrayed Jesus. Jesus sent out these twelve after instructing them, thus. Do not go into pagan territory, or enter a Samaritan town. Go rather to the lost sheep of the house of Israel. As you go, make this proclamation: the kingdom of heaven is at hand. The gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. Please be seated. Magandang umaga po sa inyong lahat and welcome to the Minor Basilica of Our Lady of the Holy Rosary. Power is given to us not for ourselves but for others. Authority as well is given for service. Diba? Pinibigay sa atin yung kapangyarihan, anumang kapangyarihan niyan para sa ibang tao, para sa iba. Ganun din yung authority para sa service. Makikita din natin yan sa, sa kalikasan, sa nature. The sun, the sun shines not for its own glory or its own satisfaction. The sun shines for the world, for people. The moon sparkles for its own, not for its own satisfaction, but for others. The rain does not refresh itself, it refreshes the earth. The mountains stand in majesty, not for its own self, but for others. 
as well as the trees that bear fruit for others, for other sustenance. So lahat ng makikita natin, lahat ng mga kahit anong kalaki o kaliit na kapangyarihan or authority is meant for others, hindi para sa sarili. Sa gospel na binasa natin, we find Jesus appointing the apostles, choosing the apostles, all 12 of them. They were chosen and they were given power to heal, not themselves, but to heal the sick and to gather the lost sheep of Israel and to proclaim that the kingdom of God is at hand. So mayro mga kapangyarihan, kakayanan na ibinigay ang Diyos. They, the Lord gave the apostles some capacities to be able to be of service not for themselves, but for others. For others. Lagi, for others. Power is for others. Authority is for service to others. They, the apostles went around, uh, kumalat sila, no? At tumulong sa mga tao by curing the sickness, by gathering those who are lost, and proclaiming the kingdom of God. They were able to nurture life, to give hope, and to proclaim the truth. So, lagi, also, for others. So, saan pupunta ito? Pupunta ito sa atin, syempre, ang application. No? Ano ngayon importansya niyan? So, the apostles were given the power and authority for others. How is that important to us? Anong say-say niyan sa atin? What does it mean for us? Well, all of us, young and old, sino man tayo, we have been given some power here and there. Yung ba malaki, yung ba maliit. But we are all, we have all been given powers. Hmm? Mga parents, meron silang power. Pero yung power nila at authority nila, hindi para sa sarili nila, kundi para sa anak nila. Kaya sila parents, they have become parents not to be feel good and say, no, ay, sarap, tatay na ako, ay, sarap, nanay na ako. Hindi eh. They have become parents for others, for their children. Teachers teach for their students, not for their own glorification. At least, it shouldn't be. Hindi dapat. No? Hindi dapat na yung teacher kay ito ang tuwa ka dahil ikaw ay teacher. Hindi, tuwa ka dahil nagbibigay ka ng kaalaman, nagperform ka ng mga students. Pare at madre, we have, you know, we have power, we have authority, but it's for the church. It's not for ourselves, but it's for, for people, no? not for ourselves. Lawyers, powers nila to defend the truth and justice, not just to earn money, but to defend the truth and justice. Government leaders, have powers for the people, not for themselves, di ba? So lahat, lahat ng powers na ibinigay sa atin para sa ibang tao. Para, sa maka, para makatulong sa ibang tao, makabigay ng mas magandang buhay, mag, more meaningful life for others. Business persons, gov, uh, engineers and scientists, architects and artists, all of these. They may have power, they may have authority, not for themselves, but for others. So ang tanong natin sa ating sarili, ano yung power ko? As a person, as one individual specific person, ano yung power ko? Huwag natin sabihin lang na power to breathe, okay din yun, di ba? But you don't just breathe for yourself, you breathe for others. Of course, kasi gagamitin mo yung buhay mo for others, no? But there are other more specific Meron tayong mag- talagang katangi-tangi no? na power na ating sarili na binigay ng Diyos. And we have to discover what that is. Kailangan natin yung ma-discover, ma-laman, ma-recognize. Ano ba yung mga power na binigay sa akin ng Diyos? Ano ba yung kakaibang power? Ano ba yung very talagang yun, namumukod-tangi sa akin na pwede kong gawin, na nagagawa ko? na may bibigay ko, may alay ko at may bibigay ko para sa iba. Ano yung power na yun? To teach, to build, to form, 
maybe to inspire or to lead other people in your own little, big, medium-sized ways to lead other people. Those are powers. Kailangan natin malaman kung ano ba yung mga power na yun na ibinigay sa atin. Of course, pag nalaman na natin kung yung mga power na yun, kailangan din natin tanong, how have we used them so far? Up to now, paano natin ginagamit yung mga powers na binigay sa atin? Have we used them for ourselves? Sana, no? Sana have we have used them for ourselves. I'm mean, sorry, we have used them for others. Sana we have used them for others. Sana hindi lang natin ginagamit para sa ating sarili. Para sa ating sarili lang nakapakanan. Pero malam, um, what affects is, um, kung paano natin magamit yung power na yan, usually depends on what is in our hearts. Kapag pure yung puso, kapag selfless din yung puso, merong selflessness, Kapag hindi masyadong maraming karamutan sa puso, eh, nakakabigay sa ibang tao. Nagagamit sa ibang tao. How we, how, what is in our hearts affects how we use our power. How we use our powers for others. Kung hindi nasa puso. So, kailangan natin ma-purify our hearts so that really we can use what God has given us for other people. For the safety, for the welfare and safety of others. So in the end, we it's nice to be able to say and to realize that we have the power. We have the power to transform the world. In our own little spaces, we don't have to be like you know a big huge person. popular na popular o masyadong malaking kapangyarihan. But we can transform the world little by little in our own little ways, in our own little areas, kung saan man tayo naroon. Kahit sa pagtitinda mo lang sa palengke o sa pagtuturo mo ng mga kindergarten o pag ano man yung ginagawa natin sa buhay. We have the power to transform the world by using our powers for other people. So we pray. We ask God, sana, ma, ma, to keep our, that God can oh, keep our hearts pure always so that we can use our powers for other people. For, so that we can use our powers at God, as God um, meant them to be used. Kung paano ginusto ng Diyos na magamit yung powers na yan for others. Let us all stand now. As God's holy people called in different ways to spread the good news of the kingdom, we place our needs before our Father who continues to care for us. After each petition, we say, God who calls, sustain us. God who calls, sustain us. That those called in the church to lead the people of God may have the courage to spread the gospel of Jesus Christ to the ends of the earth, let us pray to the Lord. God who calls, sustain us. That those who seek God may find enlightenment and respond willingly to God's invitation to be with Him, let us pray to the Lord. God who calls, sustain us. That young people may recognize the voice of Christ calling them to life of service, let us pray to the Lord. God who calls, sustain us. That the sick may receive comfort and strength from those who care for them. Let us pray to the Lord. God who calls, sustain us. For the worthy intentions of Reverend Father Roberto Reyes Opi, let us pray to the Lord. God who calls, sustain us. That our beloved dead may rest in the peace of Christ's kingdom. Let us pray to the Lord. God who calls, sustain us. Heavenly Father, when you call us in the events of everyday life, let your Spirit give each of us the strength to say, Lord, here I am. I come to do your will. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. Please be seated.
Blessed are you, Lord God of all creation, for through your goodness we have received the bread we offer you, fruit of the earth and work of human hands. It will become for us the bread of life. Blessed be God forever. Blessed are you, Lord God of all creation, for through your goodness we have received the wine we offer you, fruit of the vine and work of human hands. It will become our spiritual drink. Blessed be God forever. Please stand. Pray, my dear friends, that our sacrifice may be acceptable <clears throat> to God, the Almighty Father. May the Lord accept the sacrifice at your hands for the praise and glory of His name for our good and the good of all His Holy Church. May this oblation dedicated to your name purify us, O Lord, and day by day bring our conduct closer to the life of heaven, through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Lift up your hearts. We lift them up to the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right and just. It is truly right and just, our duty and our salvation, always and everywhere, to give you thanks, Lord, Holy Father, Almighty and Eternal God. For just as through your beloved Son you created the human race, so also through him, with great goodness, you formed it anew. And so it is right that all your creatures serve you, all the redeemed praise you, and all your saints with one heart bless you. Therefore we too extol you with all the angels as in joyful celebration we acclaim. Pinagpala ang kaparin ito sa tala ng Panginoon. O sana, o sana, o sana sa kaitaasan. O sana, o sana, o sana sa kaitaasan. Please kneel. You are indeed holy, O Lord, the fount of all holiness. Make holy, therefore, these gifts, we pray, by sending down your Spirit upon them like the dewfall, so that they may become for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time he was betrayed and entered willingly into his passion, he took bread and giving thanks, broke it and gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it, for this is my body, which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice, and once more giving thanks, he gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it, for this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. The Mystery of Faith Some Christ, I know the darling 
Therefore, as we celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection, we offer you, Lord, the bread of life and the chalice of salvation, giving thanks that you have held us worthy to be in your presence and minister to you. Humbly we pray that partaking of the body and blood of Christ, we may be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Remember, Lord, your church spread throughout the world and bring her to the fullness of charity, together with Francis, our Pope, and Socrates, our bishop, and all the clergy. Remember also our brothers and sisters who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection, and all who have died in your mercy. Welcome them into the light of your face. Have mercy on us all, we pray, that with the Blessed Virgin Mary, the Mother of God, with Saint Joseph, her most chaste spouse, with the blessed apostles and all the saints who have pleased you throughout the ages, we may merit to be co-heirs to eternal life and may praise and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ. Through him and with him and in him, O God, Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. pray not our Father in heaven in the words that our Lord himself has taught us. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Deliver us, Lord, we pray, from every evil. Graciously grant peace in our days, that by the help of your mercy, we may be always free from sin and safe from all distress, as we await the blessed hope and the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. Lord Jesus Christ, who said to your apostles, Peace I leave you, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church and graciously grant her peace and unity in accordance with your will, who live and reign forever and ever. Amen. The peace of the Lord be with you always. And with your spirit. Let us offer each other the sign of peace. Lamb of God, you, you take, take away, away the sins, sins of the world. world. Have mercy, mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world. Grant us peace. Please kneel. This is Jesus, the Lamb of God, who takes away the sins of the world. Happy are we who are called to this banquet. Lord, Lord I am not worthy that, that you should enter, enter under my roof, but only, but only say, the say the word, word and my soul shall be healed.
Let us serve the Lord in holiness all the days of our life. Blessed be the Lord, the God of Israel. He has come to His people and set them free. He has raised up for us a mighty Savior, born of the house of His servant, David. Through His holy prophets, He promised of old that He would save us from our enemies, from the hands of all who hate us. He promised to show mercy to our fathers and to remember His holy covenant. This was the oath His word to our father Abraham, to set us free from the hands of our enemies, free to worship Him without fear, holy and righteous in His sight all the days of our life. You, my child, shall be called the prophet of the Most High, for you will go before the Lord to prepare His way, to give His people knowledge of salvation by the forgiveness of their sins. In the tender compassion of our God, the dawn from on high shall break upon us, to shine on those who dwell in darkness and the shadow of death, and to guide our feet into the way of peace. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Let us serve the Lord in holiness all the days of our life. Let us pray. Grant, we pray, O Lord, that having been replenished by such great gifts, we may gain the prize of salvation and never cease to praise you. Through Christ our Lord. Amen. Maraming maraming salamat po sa inyong lahat sa pakikisa sa Santa Misa. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. May Almighty God bless you all, the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Our Mass is ended. Let us go in the peace and the love of Christ. Thanks be to God. Let us now pray for the sick and bless your religious articles. Our help is in the name of the Lord. Who made heaven and earth. God, our almighty Father, by your blessing, you give us strength and support in our frailty. Turn with kindness toward our sick brothers and sisters. Free them from all illness and restore them to good health through the intercession of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag, so that in the sure knowledge of your goodness, they will gratefully bless your holy name. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. In memory of the mysteries of the life, death, and resurrection of our Lord Jesus Christ, and to the honor and glory of the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of Christ, Mother of the Church, Our Lady of the Rosary, may all these articles be blessed and those who use them made holy as they fulfill the will of God according to the example of the Blessed Mother. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen.